the biggest thing that I saw with Legal Shield was that I was already making 100000 plus a year, but I didn't have any time freedom. I was working 60, 70 hours a week. I worked every day except for Sundays during the day, and then Sundays at 5 o'clock, I'm on the phone trying to get appointments. And so I basically was working every day. And when I saw that I can do something once and keep getting paid over and over again, I saw the, the residual income side of it. And I saw the long term. I was like, I'm in it forever. I'm not in it for a year. I'm not in it for two years. I'm just in it to win it. I'm just in it until I get what I want. And I still haven't got everything I want from Legal Shield. Um, but that's how you get rich in America. You know, we can work 40, 60 hours, 80 hours a week, and we'll have to continue to do that. But when you have a, a company that pays your residual income, that you do something once, I'm getting paid for what I did in 2001. Mm. How many of you guys ever had, had a job that you're not with, with anymore? Anyone? Are you still getting paid for that job? No. No. That's legal shit. That's legal shit. And I would have never purchased this house to make it into my office if it wasn't for Legal Shield because I don't want to have to work to make money every month. But the money that I get from Legal Shield pays for everything here. And that's powerful. So now I get to travel. I'm always gone. I'm, I, I go everywhere. I mean, I just came back um, um, for those on vacation. And then I just came back. And then I'm going to get in a couple, other week, a couple of weeks. So it gives you the time now. So if you work really, really hard in the beginning years, five, six years, you'll have that time freedom um, that will give you that lifestyle that you want. For me, it wasn't so much the money as it was the time. I just wanted to be able to do what I wanted to do when I want to do it. And that's, that's, that's lifestyle for me. I mean, that's, that's freedom for me. And so that's what Legal Shield does. And what I really liked best about Legal Shield when I first got in was, number one, that the company had been around for, it was 30 years then, because so I've been in since 2001, so mm. it was over 30 years then, so it was credible. I knew that the company was going to be around, so I like that. I don't want no startup companies. I don't want any of that kind of stuff. I want something I know if I work really hard, they're going to give me a paycheck at the end of my working hard. Um, and then two, if there wasn't a business opportunity attached to the product, you would still want to offer people the service. And that's why you know it's not a pyramid or anything like that, because if they took away the, the business opportunity, you would still want to offer the identity theft, you would still want to offer the legal share plan. So that was really important. So I knew with the product being good, if it, if it makes sense, it makes dollars. Mm. And I'm just a living proof. I, I don't have a really big team or anything. I'm, you know, there's people who make way more than me, but to, to be able to say I made the companies pay me a million dollars, that's... That still really blows my mind. Like, wow, this company's paying me a million dollars. I should have saved it all. Then I made dollars. I spend it. Every time I got a check, I spend it. <laughs> but I'm working on my second million, and starting today, I'm going to save my, the money that I made. So when I make my second million, I can actually say, I got a million saved up. That's what I really want. I want to have a million dollars in the bank uh, or mutual funds or where I want to have it. So, uh, that's my story. I love Lisa Shell. <laughs> I love it because it's it saved my life. It really did. It saved my life because a lot of financial planners now and insurance agents, they're not doing too well. I was at church today and I sent Aaron uh, to a financial planning seminar yesterday, you know, to scout out the land to see who, who, who what, what people are talking about out there. And um, the speaker's wife came up to me today and said, um, Wow, I really, I really want to do what you're doing. And so, you know, I'm going to see if she'll come to the, the briefings on Tuesday. But insurance agents and financial planners aren't really doing that well anymore. So when I say legal should really save my life, it really did. If not, I would be really struggling every day. I would still be in that rat race. Um, but now I'm not in the rat race anymore. And that, that's what's important to me. Awesome.